What's up guys? How are you doing? It is Lasty here. Welcome to a new FIFA 17 Team of the Season player review. We're going to be looking at a striker from the Russian League. It is Fedor Smolov. So, he's Russian, he's 89 rated, and he's got some pretty awesome stats. 92 pace and shooting, as well as 89 dribbling and 85 physical. Now, with those stats, he is a 6 foot 2 striker, which is pretty impressive. High medium work rates, right footed, with only 3 star skills, but he does have a nice four star weak foot so i've got a couple of different teams that you guys might like to play this sort of player in the first one is a mix between the french league gun the premier league and the russian league as well as you can see he is up front with the team of the season zayuba uh, and then the team that i actually used him in same front three uh, but it's just got a very strong premier league side uh, underneath it and it's just a really Really, really solid team. Uh, Smolov, I was actually switching him between left striker and right striker in this particular team. Uh, and he did very, very well. So, moving on into the in-game stats then. Smolov this year has had uh, a man of the match and an SBC item. Uh, and as well as this team of the season, Beauty. Now, on basic chemistry style, he does look a complete madness. Going up to like 96 shooting and stuff. Uh, but I've gone ahead and used the marksman chemistry style today. I was happy with 92 pace. I thought it might be interesting to try and boost that dribbling and physical. As well as a little bit of shooting as well. And as you can see, his shooting stats are nearly perfect across the board uh, with the marksman marksman chemistry style so moving on into the the clips part of the video we can talk pros and cons about this player we'll start with the negatives and there are a couple of what i would say are just literally minor ones nothing too big deal uh, like skill moves you know he's got three star that's average it's not too bad and when you do have the stats that smolov has in like dribbling department and stuff you can pretty much get away with just doing the LTRT and the no-touch dribbling, and you'll be absolutely fine. Um, but I know it's team of the season. There are so many items available that lots of people are looking for those four-star and above players because they're a little bit more useful in the attack. Um, and then balance. Again, it's not a huge issue. It's just not great. Uh, it's it's in the high 70s overall, and of course, you can boost that with chemistry styles, but Overall, it's because he's a big striker. You don't really expect him to have much agility and balance. The the agility he seems to have, but the, the overall balance stat is just not particularly brilliant. But it's not a massive game changer, uh, and it definitely doesn't ruin the item in my opinion. So moving on in to the positives. The first thing you notice is that, one, he's very tall, uh, and two, for such a tall player... Damn, he's quick. <laughs> he really can. He well, he really can get going. He really can get moving when he wants to. Um, both acceleration and sprint speed for me were extremely impressive. I don't think I was expecting him to, to feel that quick in game. Uh, just pulling away from defenders and stuff. It was was yeah, really fun and and, and super easy as well. He just literally pulls away from no problem at all. Um, and it, as well as being a player like that, who's who's decently well positioned. Uh, and can make those runs off the last shoulder of the defender. He's also a, a, a fantastic option as a target man. So being six foot two and having like the physical stats that he's got, uh, I was I was I found it very easy to knock the ball up from goal kicks and also have him as the the man at the front post from the corners. And Smolov's gonna win you headers. You know he is six foot two, so he's definitely gonna uh, have a bit of aerial presence for you, uh, which is obviously great. His strength is also seriously impressive. We're talking high 80s, early 90s, depending on chemistry styles that you're using. Uh, and uh, physical battles against even some of the tougher defenders in the game. Smolov is going to be able to hold his own uh, and, and use that shielding. You know, if you want to be one of those guys which holds that shielding button, uh, uh, he's actually got the agility. Not quite the balance, but he's got the agility and, and the dribbling technique. So that you can hold hold the shield button and then just quickly turn a defender and go on that run. Uh, get through on goal and take the shot. His dribbling was actually superb for a player of his stature. Uh, he was like running with the ball with ease, weaving in and out of defenders. Uh, and he keeps that ball really close to his feet as well, which is what I really liked about him. And then overall, his shooting, as we mentioned earlier, is basically perfect. Like in most of, most of the areas, it was pretty much as good as it's going to get. Uh, long shots were fantastic. We scored one belter which came off the bar. But just overall a very dangerous player with the ball at his feet. And even in the air as well. So he might cost you a little bit more than you... Well, he cost me a little bit more than I thought he was going to be. 
But overall, was very impressed with Fedor Smolov team of the season. Let me know, guys, if you've managed to use him and what you think of him down below in that comment section. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.